The Lord appeared to Abraham near the great trees of Mamre. While he was sitting at the entrance to his tent in the heat of the day, Abraham looked up and saw three men standing nearby. When he saw them, he hurried from the entrance of his tent to meet them and bowed low to the ground. He said, If I have found favor in your eyes, my Lord, do not pass by your servant. Let a little water be brought, and then you may all wash your feet and rest under this tree. Let me get you something to eat so that you can be refreshed and then go on your way. Now that you have come to your servant. Very well, they answered. Do as you say. So Abraham hurried to the tent to Sarah. Quick, he said, gather three shays of flour and knead it and bake some bread. Then he ran to the herd and selected a choice tender calf and gave it to a servant who hurried to prepare it. He then brought some curds and milk and the calf that had been prepared and set these before them. While they ate, he stood near them under a tree. Where is your wife, Sarah? They asked him. There, in the tent, he said. Then the Lord said, I will surely return to you about this time next year, and Sarah, your wife, will have a son. Now Sarah was listening at the entrance to the tent, which is behind him. Abraham and Sarah were already old and were well advanced in years, and Sarah was past the age of childbearing. So Sarah laughed to herself as she thought, After I'm worn out and my master is old, will I now have this pleasure? Then the Lord said to Abraham, Why did Sarah laugh and say, Will I really have a child now that I am old? Is there anything too hard for the Lord? I will return to you at the appointed time next year, and Sarah will have a son. Sarah was afraid, so she lied and said, I did not laugh. But he said, Yes, you did laugh.